Hi. Let's learn about book value per share, BVPS. Book value per share is the ratio of equity available to common shareholders divided by the number of outstanding shares. This figure represents the minimum value of a company's equity and measures the book value of a firm on a per share basis. The book value per share metric can be used by investors to gauge whether a stock price is undervalued by comparing it to the firm's market value per share. If a company's BVPS is higher than its market value per share, its current stock price, then the stock is considered undervalued. If the firm's BVPS increases, the stock should be perceived as more valuable, and the stock price should increase. An exception to this valuation is in bank stocks which tend to trade below their BVPS due to their increased risk from trading activities. In theory, BVPS is the sum that shareholders would receive in the event that the firm was liquidated, all of the tangible assets were sold, and all of the liabilities were paid. However, as the assets would be sold at market prices, and book value uses the historical costs of assets, market value is considered a better floor price than book value for a company. Assume that XYZ Manufacturing's common equity balance is $10 million, and that 1 million shares of common stock are outstanding. This means that the BVPS is $10 per share. If XYZ can generate higher profits and use those profits to buy more assets or reduce liabilities, the firm's common equity increases. If the company generates earnings and uses those to buy assets or reduce liabilities, common equity increases, along with BVPS. Another way to increase BVPS is to repurchase common stock from shareholders. Using the XYZ example, assume that the firm repurchases 200,000 shares of stock and that 800,000 shares remain outstanding. If common equity is $10 million, BVPS increases to $12.50 per share. While BVPS is calculated using historical costs, the market value per share is a forward-looking metric that takes into account a company's future earning power. An increase in a company's potential profitability or expected growth rate should increase the market value per share. BVPS is used mainly by stock investors to evaluate a company's stock price. If a company's BVPS is higher than its market value per share, which is its current stock price, then the stock is considered undervalued. Here are four key takeaways. 1. Book value per share, BVPS, takes the ratio of a firm's common equity divided by its number of shares outstanding. 2. Book value of equity per share effectively indicates a firm's net asset value, total assets, total liabilities, on a per share basis. 3. When a stock is undervalued, it will have a higher book value per share in relation to its current stock price in the market. 4. BVPS is used mainly by stock investors to evaluate a company's stock price. Hope this would help. Thanks for watching.